So what we're doing is a CASAVAC training for HMLA 469, and they came to us uh, looking to build somewhat of a high fidelity little training plan. So what we did, we kind of meshed some of our TCCC and CLS programs into what they were looking for. I think it's a very positive curriculum that's been created, and I think that every air crew member, whether they are a CASAVAC or medevac unit, they should try to consider uh, implementing this into their programs and actually doing this training for themselves. It's a simple program. It's crawl, walk, run. Crawl being PowerPoint, classroom. Walk being out here on the flight line doing a little bit of hands-on training, actually applying some tourniquets. And then run is actually out in the field uh, operating under those type of conditions and actually treating wounds and doing the actual CASAVAC type mission. And it's critical that we conduct this training during training events because it hasn't been that long ago MAG-39 was doing these in combat. And then when we get the call to go, we're not going to have a lot of time to prepare, oftentimes. So we have to be ready and so we train to this standard uh, frequently and that interaction between the Marines and sailors uh, is critical, especially in the assault support and CASVAC role. In the off chance that they actually do become a CASVAC or a medevac entity, they're going to be uh, trained with a little bit of familiarization and already have a little bit of hands-on training for future efforts. 